Welcome to episode one of the Comicast. I'm Shelleron. This week's episode is a little bit of a sample platter, if you will, to get new listeners acquainted with our antics. Act one this week is me grilling Skylar, my best friend, Chris, girlfriend, on just why she's dating such an ugly, ugly motherfucker. <laughs> you, don't, you don't have to answer that. I feel like she does. But you really should. <laughs> like, mathematically, it just doesn't make sense. Logically, it doesn't make sense. It just doesn't oh. make sense across the board. Okay, did he tell you that, like, when we started dating, like, for a while, mm. he would tell her when we, because we used to work together, right. and, like, he would tell her boss, like, when I got a good shift and he liked it, he'd be like, oh, Skylar doesn't like that shift, and he'd take it. What? <laughs> <laughs> what a fucking well, you're making You're making it worse, Skylar, why are you? Okay, no. so not, Why are you doing not this? hold on. Not only is he numerically below you, but he's also an asshole. So <laughs> I ask the question again. You're why? How? I thought we were boy and girl. Okay, here's my here's here's I guess the question I'm getting to. He's gotta be huge, right? That's that's it, right? Jesus. Skylar. Okay. <laughs> you... <laughs> this is ridiculous. Because I feel like that's the only thing that would explain it. Because he's not rich. He's a dick. <laughs> There's no possibility that in the future he'll ever be rich. He's... Oh, you don't know that. He's, at, know best, that. he's at best a You're five. the biggest asshole. I'm just, I hate I'm you. I'm just not understanding it here. I hate your guts. Is, is the pool that limited in wherever the hell y'all are? Are you... Oh, Sam Marcus. What are you trying bad. to? What's your end game here, bro? Just to to get some questions answered. He's honestly. an agent of chaos, much like myself. We like friction. Okay, I'm trying to figure out how to answer this. Okay. Uh, you you're welcome to always just say that it's all been a mistake. <laughs> Don't yeah. actually say that. That'd be really mean. What is? <laughs> well. He was a lot nicer when I met him. No! <laughs> what? That's what my mother says about my dad. They hate each other, so. Well, like, wow. well I guess he didn't uh, show me, like, this I feel side. like shit. No, 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 but I still love you. <laughs> okay. What? That makes sense. Hold on. That makes no, sense. What? Because, hold on. Chris. No, no, no. No, no, no. Let me finish. Let me finish. That I don't even sense. think I should be in here anymore. I get it. I get that part. That makes sense. Sure. No, it, right. Okay. It makes sense because. But why like, the fuck did you take him back? Wow. You literally Jesus. had an <laughs> Okay, like... Because, wow. like, I couldn't, like... Because I love him. Yeah, I, we all love Chris. We understand. Yeah, right, like, but it doesn't I, make sense. I, uh, <laughs> but, it, but, it, but it does. So, see, I see. I think I see what's going on here, you guys. Because, like she said, she, he used to be nicer. He, at first... She's attracted to the niceness. Now, I, he's, now he's becoming now he's becoming a hard ass, and that no, makes I'm her st- hot for him. And I understand that. I somehow I'm, don't feel like that's the situation. I'm no. still nice. He's still nice, but yeah, he's got an are. edge now. He's got he's got. Can, How do what what did what, I, what did I do that was wrong, mean? Correct me if I'm well, wrong. it's not that you're mean to me, but you you just say a lot of like mean things about everything. Well, to be fair, people are kind of shitty, so I understand his his perspective there. No, I mm. I understand it too, like. Like, wait, wait, I think the the word you're looking for is dated. Here's my I, follow-up I question: Did we do this to him? Did we? No. I don't know. Or did we? we just, did we just polish the jades that were already mm-hmm. there? And here's another follow-up question: Maybe he's right, and you're the wrong one here. Wow. And in what regard? Maybe she's too nice about everything. Maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe she needs to level up her jerkness mm-hmm. a little. I don't know what to say. No, I'm a mean person, kind of. You should maybe consider being a bitch to everyone for a while and see how it feels. Just to just to see what the other side's like. You know, acquire a dark side and maybe play the video game Dark Siders. Oh my god, this is getting frustrating. This conversation is a little frustrating. Hello, no, not the conversation, I'm talking about this game. Well, Ogon's here apparently. I thought I saw his mic light up, so so I like his input on the matter. He yeah, should be a sexy boy. Reason. That's what I'll say about Argon. Yeah, Jay, this is oh. this is a subject that's over. Hmm. That is is a subject no. that's over. I feel like I'm feel like I'm still confused. Okay, 
here's your simple answer. Okay. He's nice to me. He okay. makes me happy. Okay. And I got back together with him because I love him. Everyone okay. deserves a second chance. Okay. okay. What did he do on his first <laughs> chance? That he fucked up so badly? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Austin, is, oh Austin my god. is the one step behind now. <laughs> Yeah, oh, you're yeah. so far behind. <laughs> I'm not Please. a regular here. Let's Basically, I made... Okay, shut up. Basically, I made the assumption that she wouldn't want to live with an artist that's fucking moving all around and... Just... Yeah. Artist, air quotes. Artist. Oh my... I'm... I'm gonna fuck you up. <laughs> You'll have a chance. Have a chance. Soon. Mm. Oh yeah, and about, like, the rich thing. I don't know, it doesn't really matter, because, like... That's okay. I'll because probably make a lot okay, of money. Okay, now I really don't understand. Wow. Is she saying because she'll make a lot of money? <laughs> <laughs> it's, no, it's kind of, it's kind of, see, it's, actually, you shouldn't worry about it because eventually we're all going to violently revolt and kill the rich. So you don't want to be rich. Uh, y'all niggas better not. Daniel, you're not really rich. Your parents are rich. Well, I'll, I will, I you're will not. be. But you're, he benefits from it. Yeah. Well, you should just disown your parents and join the revolution. I will Why be. Why would I do that? I do that. Because, I don't know, because positive change is more important than your family. Oh, literally, uh, rich white southerner. Yeah, you're just, wow. literally a wasp. Yeah, why would you give that up? Okay, so Dan, do you have your answer? It still doesn't make sense to me, but whatever. <sighs> See, it things never like, make sense. When you explain something like this to Daniel, you're kind of pushing a square peg through a circle hole. If you, if you guys, if you guys, if you okay. <laughs> wow. Really, we're going there with that. I it's something making, you can't understand until you're in I a situation. I was making a clever comment on, on autism, autism because, you know, they would try it back. I'm just saying the math doesn't line up, so. Well, you don't have to be, stop being a logical person. Well, he, logical he Chris is taking algebra right now, so that What are you, help. Spock now? But, but, I mean. Got him. Yeah, he'll take it. Okay. <laughs> the math Ju doesn't line up. Judges say 10 points. <laughs> Ew, I'm Daniel. I make everything out of the gist of. Is that make everything out of the gist? impression? Yeah. Oh, that's that was a little weak. Good, Daniel. Eh, I've heard better. Act two of this week's podcast is from New Year's Eve, when myself, Christopher, Devin, and our good friend Donnie were in Mumble. Devin, at this point, was three sheets to the wind, shit faced, if you will. And he happened to send a picture of his dink a link to Donnie. So, that happened. Mm. Hey guys. Well, now that's said and done. She thought you were kidding and you actually did it? Well, I can't actually tell I was kidding. I don't fuck around. Anyways, let's move on to the next subject of tonight's discussion. Um, in my possession, I currently have a cool house spelled H A U S brand ice cream sandwich on sale these run for four dollars fifty cents individually this flavor is um chocolate chip cookie with brown butter candied bacon ice cream in the middle okay Are you guys following um i'm currently trying one of these for the first time just like you know i I'm kind still kind of, of stuck on the, the the fucking fact that you actually sent Donnie we're a taking picture of your wiener. This, we're taking this adventure together, guys. <laughs> the wiener thing is in the past. We're talking about this this ice cream sandwich now. This is a great but expensive ice cream sandwich. I'm going to take a bite currently and give you guys a play-by-play. -play. Okay. First things first. Cookies have a good chew to them, okay? Um, vanilla ice cream hits you immediately. Are we really not listening to New Year's predictions because of this? <laughs> I don't know, I kind of muted it a long ass time ago because I wasn't too interested. Uh, yeah, I'm moving it. Well, it hadn't started yet. Oh my god, it hadn't started yet. Oh, I think you get a bit of a caramel flavor from the... From I, don't the know, I still wasn't interested, though. From the brown sugar, and then you taste the bacon. The bacon hits you, and you're like, oh my god, this is bacon ice cream. It's a common gimmick nowadays, but this is a very high quality... Very high quality no ice cream sandwich. No one cares. Oh my god. To my knowledge, it's completely organic. Um, I can't understand <laughs> what justifies the 450 price tag per piece on sale, but I mean, Daniel, in his say, defense, it's, he's it's a, pretty fucking drunk. So it's a great experience, though. It's a it, it's worth experiencing at least once in your lifetime. 450 is not a high price to ride. It's about the price of the Steam game currently. 
Yeah, but Steam games last way longer than ice cream sandwiches. But this is art. So is Steam games. Video games aren't art. I've covered this in a GBS 2.10, Red. Uh, yeah. I can say right now that you're, like, more than wrong than you'll ever be. Okay, that's so. cool choice. I'm moving the bot back in here. I want to listen to You need to check out my thread, um, anime versus video games. Oh my god, are you, are, so are you defending anime saying it's art versus video uh, no, games? no, I, I let the users of Something Awful decide which was more artful, and they decide anime was. Oh dear I'm merely, god. I am, I am merely the observer. I am not the judge. So I, I, not an art. It really isn't an art. It's the fucking same ass style in 80 million different stories. Pretty much. Just gonna say that. Anyways, um, cool house. Uh, let's go. Let's go down the ratings. Um, taste five out of five. Value um two out of five. It's still too expensive for how good it tastes. Um, packaging. The packaging actually looks like a bit like a car. Um, I'm gonna have to say that that's about a four out of five. Uh, I feel like it keeps it cool longer if you keep it unopened too. It seems like some special ass packaging. Um. The cookies are honestly pretty great cookies, even on their own. On their own merit, the cookies are pretty damn great. But with the ice cream, <laughs> you, don't even, you don't even know what's going on. Anyways, what I would recommend, yes, I would recommend everybody tries this ice cream sandwich at least once. Um, but can I can, can I have real talk for a second? Pie. Yes. What would you like to talk about, sir? Can I kind of drop a bomb here? Mm -hmm. I think you're just nervous. That's why you're trying to make this whole fucking <laughs> conversation about your ice cream because you just sent on a picture of your dick. So I'm just, fucking, just gonna say that right now. <laughs> Can you not stand what's going on right now? Is Chris losing his mind? Over... <laughs> Dude, Chris is going crazy over a PS picture he didn't even get. <laughs> no, I don't even want one. I'm just saying I, no. it's funny to see this to see you covering up the situation with a fucking review for a fucking can... little ice cream. <laughs> you're, you're you're nervous. Okay. That's what you are. So you're just nervous. you're trying you're trying to move the subject onto gone. what you're eating. Resounding because, reviews. Because, resounding. Uh, five out of five. Well, you didn't get a resounding review from this one. That's that's why you're moving on. To... <laughs> No, actually, you know what? I am not going to disclose that information. That is between me and Citizen A here. You okay, maybe maybe I wasn't included in the text conversation. I'm just saying there wasn't much. the conversation if you want to see it. You can you choose to, to see it, and you can be included. You can be included if you want to see it. No. Okay? No. Otherwise, <laughs> otherwise, we're talking about my goddamn fucking ice cream sandwich, okay? Ice I don't cream know. Sandwich, I feel like overall, this is a cover-up situation. I'm gonna say this is a cover-up conversation. I'm going to say that overall, is. the ice cream sandwich rates at about 3.8 out of 5, um, all factors combined. My penis rates at about a 4.5 out of 5, I would say. Um, it could be improved in some areas. Notably, I wish I was about 20 inches larger, but that's not realistic. I'm completely happy with being about average size. I'm satisfied with it. It, it does what it says on the packaging. Um, it has some nice features. It's feature rich, I would say. Um, very good cool design. <laughs> Minimalist, but effective. Um, uh, I lost, no all, con I, I no lost all control of the situation. Point is, ice cream sandwiches and penises are both great. That, uh, well... I can stop there recording it. there. <laughs> In the final segment, we discuss an apparent fascination with Sonic by multiple mentally ill people. We make fun of said mentally ill people, and we discover a very, very, very humiliating fact from Chris's past. What is Otis like fascination and fixation on Sonic in particular? I don't know, just Why one of those Sonic? things. Sonic? That is podcast material. It's not Mario. It's not Zelda. It's not... Sometimes it's Pokemon. Sometimes it's Pokemon. Did I say Pokemon? You didn't say Pokemon, but I'm just saying. Uh, no, no, Pokemon's one of them, but it's not like Sonic. Like, literally someone once I read once, you can Google pretty much any name. Okay, so like X is like your name. You can Google mm. X the Hedgehog. And yeah. literally, you get twenty results. Yeah. Any name possible. Okay. In fact, let me put in Devin. The. Yeah. See, it auto completes it for me. Jesus. Google literally auto completes it for me. Oh, I and gotta see what Chris the Hedgehog looks like. There's, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine. There's like ten unique results for it. Guys, first page. Look how fucking badass I am as a headshot. Oh my god. Oh my god. And see, look at all the, my piercings, dude. What is what is the cat like? Why? Why? Why Sonic? I don't know what the obsession is. Like Sonic games weren't. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say something maybe controversial, but Sonic games have never struck me as even particularly good. You know, this this there. You know, like their their biggest merit is being old ish games. They're an old intellect. Like or, or an old intellectual property, I should say. It's like a it's like a gateway drug into furryism. Right? Yeah, it is. I think it is. It's like an acceptable way of like. Transitioning into furrydom. Because if someone calls you out, and you're like, "No, no, no, I just, I just like Sonic." And the same in the way with Pokemon. But Pokemon is understandable because literally to like play all the Pokemon games would take years. You could probably grind out the Sonic games in a matter of hours. Yeah. There's not a lot of backstory there. Oh Jesus Christ! Oh fuck me! I just stumbled across the wrong subreddit. Oh God. Are the hedgehog? Uh, oh God! Oh no! Okay, it's 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 made fun of. Him. Okay, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. you can... I gotta see what Devin the hedgehog looks like. It's it's scary. The most normal oh, woman. Oh God, Devin, here you are. Man. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Why are the yeah, so like all. ungodly? For some huge. reason. For some reason, Daniel is specifically a green hedgehog. Hmm. But you're badly drawn. Well, art reflects life, huh? I think this should just be like our... Like, this is shows... Like, you know with, with Devin's, he's like more in tune with his uh, gay side than most of us. What is he even fucking saying? What are you even saying? I have no idea. So, <laughs> I was trying to say... So it kind of fits <laughs> the whole female thing. Fit oh, gee, oh Daniel, my fucking god, are, are with the badly drawn. I <laughs> 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 just you mean that, that, like the drawings of some autists on the internet is like literally prophetic of her personalities. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. And then I have maybe maybe I have some dark like feelings like deep down inside my heart. Like, let's see what we get when we Google up Liz the Hedgehog. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yikes. Yeah. The more you look at like these pictures, the more you see there's like there's a scale of like you know basic, just like okay, this is a Sonic like recolor, and then it just smoothly ramps up until at one point you're like okay. This is furry. This is a completely different character. <laughs> yeah. Or no, this is this is like this is furry. This is where furry begins. Yeah, this, this is an original character that they're modeling after themselves. This is yeah. well, can it's I their, have it's a their uh, fursona? It's Babby's first fursona. Yeah, anyway. pretty much. Yeah, it's, it's like the can I have a moment of admittance here? Oh, gee, oh here god. We god, don't! Oh my god! <laughs> Say, Jesus Christ! Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Way back, <laughs> 2000, 2006, maybe. Uh, yeah, I'll just send you an image. Oh, oh no. God. He's gonna send us his first song, isn't he? What is this, Chris? Something great. What is this, Chris? Sonic form? What is this, Chris? Explain this bullshit. <laughs> uh, no, it's understandable. Like, actually, no, it's not understandable if these kids are. Oh, I just who are read doing here where it says. Thing. First off, this was three years ago. No, this was my. I redrew them. If you want to actually see when it was, I can send you the fucking sprites uh, I made of them. I feel like you're weaseling out of this one. No, what, no, no. I'm not what's weaseling out of it. Why? It's actually why? wolfing out of it. <laughs> oh yeah, nice. Why did you do this? Is my question. Well, if this if this was drawn several years ago, it's kind of no, it wasn't. It wasn't is drawn it? several years ago. This is me being bored and going back to drawing the characters I once drew before. Right, but why the initial time? Huh? Why did you do it initially? Oh, okay, because... I mean, I was a little bit of a loser in middle school. Yeah, we know. Yeah. And there was like a... There was, a, there was like a forum that everybody went to. Oh, here we oh. go. 
Uh, who they didn't like make Near their own vets. Sonic characters. <laughs> they didn't make their own Sonic characters that represented themselves. They made it more towards. Like, uh, well, at least this is this is me. I didn't fucking try to make a Sonic character that represented myself. Ooh, I was just trying to make it. like. It was, it was a more of a nerdy thing where it was like, oh, I'm gonna give this guy superpowers. I'm gonna make this cool badass yeah, character. Yeah, yeah, pretty I much like that one. Yeah. yeah. I wanted to be like, yeah, Another this is gonna be the fucking strongest. Basically, I went to this forum, and they would like. I would read little fan fiction comic sprite comics basically that people made up with their uh with their with their created sprites of their fucking sonic recolors and I was like, you know what? I got to be better than these kids. I got to make my own. And so I like fucking went into the sprite thing and made my own sonic and then added a few little oh, wingdings and shit there. But basically uh I just did it to be better than everybody. <laughs> because that uh, oh, you did a bang up job of that. <laughs> that demographic seems to be full of bad artists, and I just kind of wanted to drop by and be oh, like, "I see, okay. I see." Well, I don't really basically, understand it, so but to you're give younger, myself so. to give myself a self like to feel better about myself, I guess, because I I I because in like high school and fucking not high school but middle school, I was a bitch and got oh, picked I, on I, a I, bunch. I get it. I get it. I get that. Yeah. Makes sense. No, I just wanted to be like that internet kid that's like better than drawing at people. It, it is your thing for for a time. I understand. Um, but yeah, what was, what was I gonna say? I had something to say about the topic. I'm glad um, it didn't. I'm not 21 and still drawing that shit though. Yeah, that makes well, me nobody happy. wants to be that way. Nobody wants to be that way. I'm not Chris Chan, dude. I'm Chris Hoover. Daniel left. He's like, I can't Don't handle hurt. this shit. <laughs> yeah. Well, um. Anyways, yeah, those those sure are some wolves that you, that you drew. Actually, they don't even look like wolves, but it's okay. It, it, it doesn't. It is basically Jesus, the you need Jesus. the way to judge the way to judge which animal it was, but it was by the tail. That's usually how it works. Cause that's true. At least even that's in, how like, it was. Even way in like back. the Sonic games, like they don't look anything like the actual animals they represent. But you know, I mean, like like we're saying, Sonic, Pokemon, to an extent, all that shit. That is a big magnet for artists. And if if you look at somebody like Chris Chan, like the Sonic thing, yeah, 